Welcome back friends, I'm Trevin here with Growing with the Rileys. Thanks again for joining. Today, let's talk wood chips in the chicken run. You got me on the way to work. I'm starting to kind of like these formats, just sitting and talking. I could let's talk backyard homesteading. With backyard homesteading, we raise egg laying chickens in our backyard, and we love those chickens. We love the, they kind of give you that sense of, you know, that homesteading personal freedom, even when you're in town and you don't have much land. They're a great animal to have. Kickstart your homesteading adventures. So, that being said, with our chicken run, we put roughly eight to 10 inches of wood chips in our chicken run. Some of the people that we follow, that we really admire in what they do, they talk about doing stuff like this. Uh, Justin Rhodes, Joel Salatin, uh, there's many more that do this. These are the two uh, people that we've, again, followed kind of the most and um, it's given us this Kind of giving us this idea or uh, concept in wood chips in the chicken run. We can't have free range chickens, so we have to kind of have our chickens in an isolated area. Reason number one, it keeps the smell down. Now, when I say that, again, we live in town. We want to be cognizant of our neighbors. See, when you think of chicken farms, foul smells can totally be associated with that and being in town you know that's one of the reasons I think there's some people that are uh, you know, can be against having chickens in town because of the smell so one of the one of the ways we combat that is with the wood chips now when you put the wood chips in you want to pile you can't just put a small layer down but you want to put thick layer we put eight to ten inches you can put more uh, that's any higher for us, it's gonna basically, in a sense, overspill out of the, the the run. So we wanna, that's about how high we can go. When we found in the, in the years we've been doing it, it works great. It keeps the smell down. Our neighbors haven't complained once about the smell, so that's a plus. Okay, everyone, so chicken manure is also full of nitrogen. All the nitrogen that they're depositing, right, in manure form, is being mixed with the it's being mixed with the the wood chips which the wood chips are full of carbon well if you get where i'm going nitrogen mixed with carbon actually makes compost which leads me to my next point the reason why we do it it helps make a compost for our garden now chicken manure by itself is too high in nitrogen it would burn down it would burn out kind of it would it would, in a sense, burn out our plants. It would be uh, too hot. Uh, you know, when you mix these two um, materials together, you know, especially when it's colder, you can just see the steam rolling off these compost piles. Well, it's breaking down and it's working together um, to create this organic matter, which, in a sense, in turn, can feed your plants, can feed your garden, and it's a really cool um, process to see. So that's another reason why we do it. And actually, again, chick manure by itself is really potent. The carbon, the wood chips, I mean, kind of have a, a decent smell, but you mix those two things together, it actually creates the sweet smelling compost that feeds your plants, that feeds your garden. Uh, and that alone is a benefit in itself. All right, so all this compost, all this nutrition, that uh, the compost brings uh, kind of leads us to the third point. There's a lot of activity in the soil because we use wood chips. What do I mean by activity? It keeps the chickens active. Chickens like to dig and scratch and uh, forge, or forge for their food. Uh, yes, we feed them. We have a feed that we give them uh, every day. But there are times now when it rains, it keeps 
that that uh, the wood chips actually keep the rain and they keep the moisture in the ground so that ground underneath the wood chips never really completely dries out it stays moist stays loose we have a lot more activity in the soil we got a lot more worms we got a lot more grubs we got a lot more you know all sorts of bugs and critters like that that live in the soil well guess what chickens like to dig chickens like to scratch and they get free food through that and so that's another one of those benefits of using the wood chips in the chicken run you're asking well how do we get all these wood chips or how do you get all these wood where do you get all these wood chips we get our wood chips from our local recycling center and then we have in the past been able to talk to some tree companies that they're doing work in the area we just contact them and then have them as long as they're using a chipper uh, they can come and dump a, a big load of wood chips in our yard yeah all sorts of benefits like you said using wood chips in the chicken run um, again we want to be cognizant of our neighbors so it helps keep the smell down it creates great compost for your garden and it also creates a lot of activity for your chickens to dig to find those worms and grubs and create free food uh, throughout um, throughout their run since again we can't free range they're not free range chickens we have to keep them in the run in a sense they're free range that way but this way we give them an environment where they're you know able to be chickens they're able to scratch and feed and um, forage for for some of their food and you know again with our chicken straps we throw them in there and it also helps mix you know we throw a lot of greens into that into our run as well that also helps break down the compost break down the wood chips for compost for our garden as well again i thank you guys for joining i uh, hope you guys like this type of content let me know in the comments below and uh, we hope to catch you guys later have a good one bye